when a smartphone like the Samsung Galaxy A50 can't make phone calls anymore, you have to determine immediately the reason why such a problem occur, especially if the phone was working fine prior to the problems. It might be an issue with the network, your account, or the area you're in may not have a good coverage. But it's also possible that the problem is with your phone and that's one of the reasons why you need to do some troubleshooting procedures. In this video, I will be showing you what to do if your Galaxy A50 can't make phone calls. First solution, force reboot your phone first. When it comes to problems that occur without apparent reason, it's best to begin your troubleshooting with a forced reboot because there's always a possibility that the cause of the problem is just a minor issue in the system or even just a glitch. These things can easily be rectified by the forced restart. To do this, press and hold the volume down button and a power key for 10 seconds or more. Once the A50 logo shows, release both keys and wait for your phone to finish rebooting. Second solution, call tech support to inquire about your account and the networks. When it comes to problems like this, your service provider is the one that could help you properly. Why? Because they have all the information about your account and your status, including your system and whether or not your account is barred from using certain services. If it's not about the status of your account, then they also have all the necessary tools that could fix the problem if the issue is in the service level. Moreover, if it's a network issue, you will be advised as to when the problem will be resolved. Unless it's a serious network problem, outages may only last about an hour or two, and if it's the case, there's nothing you can do but wait. Third solution, back up your files and reset your phone. After calling your service provider and your Galaxy A50 still can't make phone calls, and you're advised to bring the phone back to the store so that a technician can check it for you, then it's best to reset it to protect your personal information. But before the reset, make sure to create a backup of your important files and data. When ready, follow these steps. Swipe down from the top of the screen and then tap the settings icon. Find and tap general management. Touch reset. Tap factory data reset. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen and tap reset. If prompted, enter your PIN, password, or patterns. Finally, tap delete all. I hope that this simple troubleshooting guide has been helpful. We would appreciate it if you can like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more videos in the future. Thanks for watching.